Hi, Roy Williams with Airframe Components, and today our topic of discussion will be Piper wing spar corrosion, uh, particularly Piper Service Bolton 1006. In Piper Service Bolton 1006, uh, that calls for replacement of flexible fuel lines uh, by removing the forward fuel tank on the Piper wings. This is on the PA28, PA32 series aircraft. Uh, while you remove the fuel tank and change out the flexible fuel line, you are also doing an inspection for internal corrosion on the wing spar. Today, for demonstration purposes, we have a right-hand Piper Aero Wing, a PA-28R wing, and we will be removing the fuel tank uh, for access to the interior structure. With the fuel tank removed from the leading edge of the wing, this gives us access to the interior structure of the wing. Uh, you can see this is immediately outboard of the wing walk area on the right hand wing, uh, just ahead of the flap area on each left and right hand wings. Service Bolton 1006 uh, has you remove the fuel tank from the wing and replace the flexible fuel line here at the inboard portion of the tank but while the fuel tank is removed from the wing you will be inspecting the interior of the wing not just the wing spar but the overall condition of the wing structure checking for corrosion checking for cracks checking for any type of damage that uh, may be hidden uh, while the wing is uh, normally assembled together the PA-28 and 32 series aircraft have an inboard spar that is of aluminum extruded I-beam construction. Uh, this uh, particular spar uh, goes out to just outboard of the fuel tank area, but this is the area we want to inspect during uh, service bolt in 1006 while we have the fuel tank removed. You can see on this particular wing here, we have an excellent example of uh, corrosion on the main spar. You can see these areas right here where the material has bubbled up, has burst, and has flaked apart in different layers. This is what we're looking for during the uh, inspection process of uh, Service Bolton 1006. The PA-28R and PA-32R series aircraft are prone to corrosion also in the landing gear area. Uh, this area is uh, open to the elements, open to uh, moisture, to salt, to grime. Uh, also, a good area to look at on retractable pipers is where the hydraulic actuator lines may lie against the material of the spar, uh, causing corrosion over an extended period of time.